On May 14, 2018, the stage was set for a thrilling showdown in a nine-set nine-ball duel. I might miss this ball. With a massive cash prize up for grabs, the anticipation was through the roof. Join us as we take a look at the highlights of the thrilling match and analyze what exactly happened when Efren Reyes decided to give this billiards player what she deserved. Early Game Analysis Known as the most dynamic and captivating figure in the WPBA circuit for nearly two decades, the spirited Texas Tornado burst onto the professional scene in 1991. Within a short span, she left a huge mark, securing three WPBA titles in just two years and clinching the esteemed pool and billiard magazine Player of the Year accolade for her exceptional performance in 1992. Throughout her career, she has won an impressive number of 16 notable titles, including 15 WPBA championships spanning eras dominated by illustrious players such as Lori John Jones, Robin Bell, Ewa Lawrence, and Allison Fisher. In this thrilling showdown, Vivian Villarreal found herself pitted against none other than the undisputed titan of billiards, Efren Bata Reyes. The magician stands as one of the greatest players in the realm of professional billiards. He particularly known for his mastery of the demanding one-pocket discipline. With a staggering collection of over 100 international titles, Reyes has a distinguished legacy that includes unrivaled feats, such as being the first player to secure the WPA World Championships in two distinct pool disciplines. Reyes has etched his name in history as a WPA World Nine Ball Champion, a WPA World 8-Ball Champion, and a U.S. Open 9-Ball Championship victor. He has also asserted his dominance with resounding victories at esteemed tournaments such as the Sands Regency 9-Ball Open, the All-Japan Championship, the WPA Asian 9-Ball Tour, and the Derby City Classic, where he holds a record-breaking 13 titles. His unmatched prowess was shown in his victory over American champion Earl Strickland on two occasions in the Color of Money Challenge matches, securing the winner-takes-all purse of $100,000 in their initial encounter in 1996, an unprecedented milestone in pool history at the time. The clash between Reyes and Villarreal pitted the seasoned veterans' expertise against Villarreal's aggressive flair. As the players positioned themselves for the break, all eyes were on who would seize the advantage, and it turned out to be Vivian Villarreal. With a bold move, she kicked things off by sinking the nine ball right from the get-go. However, the momentum shifted when Efren Reyes chose to play defensively on the one ball, leading Villarreal to take a risk with a jump shot that failed to hit the mark. It was clear to everyone present that it was a costly error. Vivian's inadvertent scratch left Efren Reyes in control, with the cue ball in hand, primed to pocket the one ball and line up for the two ball. With a gentle stroke, Reyes delicately spun the ball, guiding it smoothly into position for the three ball. His execution showcased the finesse that defines his gameplay. It appeared that Reyes was intent on delivering a memorable performance for the fans, while Villarreal, aware of the challenge posed by this formidable opponent, seemed to feel the pressure. Yet, as the match unfolded, Reyes demonstrated why he is hailed as a legend in the pool world, exhibiting precision and poise with every shot and solidifying his status among the greats. Entering the second round, the magician showcases his skill by swiftly securing a 2-0 lead with a combination shot involving the one and two balls, swiftly advancing the scoreboard to a commanding 3-0. With confidence brimming, Reyes sets his sights on wrapping up the match as quick as possible. However, fate takes a twist when Vivian swiftly pockets the one ball, applying significant force in her attempt to nudge it towards the two ball and nearly sinking the nine with the power in her shot. Yet the magician falters on the next shot with the two ball. Vivian then decides to utilize the rails to pocket the two ball but falls short. In contrast, Reyes effortlessly sinks the nine ball with a smooth stroke seamlessly transitioning to pocket the three ball and positions himself up for the four ball. Mid-game highlights. The spectators can't help but marvel at the magician's prowess, especially considering Efren Reyes's advanced age, well over 65 years old at the time of this match. He's facing off against a much younger Vivian Villarreal, who is still in her prime. 
While analysts suggest that Reyes's peak performance spanned from 1990 to 2010, it's understandable that he might not be operating at his peak. So when he sets up for the nine ball but misses, it's forgivable, yet it ultimately hands the round to Vivian. As the match progresses, the magician attempts to pocket a ball using the rail but resorts to defensive play instead. Sensing an opportunity to capitalize, Vivian tries to humiliate him by aiming for a side pocket shot, only to miss. This gives Reyes possession of the one ball soon enough. In a spectacular turn of events, the magician executes an extraordinary shot, much to the crowd's delight. serving Vivian a dose of poetic justice she deserves. Witnessing the trajectory of that ball, you can truly grasp how rare such a shot is in the history of billiards. It ricochets off the side several times, yet defies the odds to pocket the nine ball, a testament to its validity in nine ball, signaling the transition to the next round. With the score now standing at 4-1 to one in favor of Efren Reyes, it's undeniable that the magician's skill in his prime was accompanied by a fair share of luck evident in this match. Seizing the moment, Villarreal flexes her skills by confidently sinking the two ball, demonstrating a commendable performance. Without hesitation, she swiftly progresses to pocketing the three ball, displaying precision and power. It's clear that Villarreal has immense potential, as she maintains her composure and precisely executes shots. But the main question on everyone's minds is, will her skill be enough to overcome the master? As she lines up for the five ball and cleanly sends it into the pocket, hopes begin rising for the champ. However, she doesn't quite get it right as she fails to pocket the six ball, inadvertently leaving the table wide open for the magician. In a moment of disbelief, Villarreal grapples with the consequences of her error, realizing the gravity of the situation. Efren Reyes seizes the opportunity, leveraging every ounce of skill to narrow the gap to six to two. With strategic finesse, he orchestrates a series of moves, swiftly escalating the score to seven, two. Despite the daunting odds, it must be acknowledged that Vivian Villarreal's performance was commendable maintaining resilience and providing Reyes with formidable competition. Though she positions herself for the six ball, the looming presence of the seven ball proves to be a formidable adversary, prompting her to shift her focus to the eight ball. However, fortune takes a turn for the worse as Vivian attempts to pocket the nine ball, encountering a stroke of serious bad luck. There. The nine ball teeters at the edge of the pocket, out of her reach. In response, the magician deftly pulls out his bag of tricks, executing a smooth shot that caroms off two rails to cleanly pocket the six ball. Meanwhile, as Bata Reyes lines up for the seven ball, Vivian Villarreal stands poised with the mechanical bridge, ready to seize her opportunity. With precision, she lines up for the eight ball and effortlessly sinks the nine ball, making it appear effortless as she clinches round number three, advancing the score to eight, three. Securing a victory against the magician is no small feat, so Vivian's overjoyed celebration is undeniably well-earned. However, with the magician maintaining a significant lead, his determination only intensifies as he seeks to further assert his dominance. Despite Badareas' advantage, he graciously allows Vivian to pocket the two ball, showcasing sportsmanship amid the competition. Vivian capitalizes on this opportunity, executing a tactical combination that earns her applause from the crowd, late game and conclusion. Yet the magician decides he's had enough and swiftly seizes control of the game, leveraging his signature Z shot to completely alter the course of play. This famous shot, pioneered by Efren Reyes during the 1995 Sands Regency Reno Open Concierta 1, has remained a highlight for billiards enthusiasts ever since. Facing a seemingly insurmountable challenge, Reyes employed the Z-Shot as a last-ditch effort back in 1995, executing a two-rail kick shot at a speed that astonishingly pocketed the five-ball, leaving him in prime position for the six-ball. Even esteemed commentator Jim Rempe, alongside his rival at the time... <laughs> Put the camera on, Earl. Yeah, Earl's even 
Keep clapping on that shot. Keepers. Earl Strickland couldn't help but applaud Reyes's remarkable feat. Over the years, fans have debated whether Reyes intended to pocket the five ball or merely achieve a legal hit, making this shot a subject of ongoing fascination and discussion. You can watch the unbelievable shot when it was first made on YouTube and draw your own conclusions. <laughs> Continuing the match, Vivian Villarreal successfully pockets the five ball, breaking up the cluster consisting of the eight, six, and nine balls. With precision, she targets the six ball, aiming for the side pocket with remarkable power. However, Efren Reyes intervenes, choosing to play defensively on the six ball and executing a flawless hide. Villarreal is visibly taken aback, grappling with the realization of the magician's strategic move, rendering her unable to make contact with the six ball and granting Reyes cue ball in hand. Despite Villarreal's valiant efforts and flashes of brilliance, Reyes's seasoned experience and tactical prowess shine through, allowing him to maintain a consistent lead. While Villarreal manages to secure rounds, underscoring her talent and resilience, it becomes increasingly evident that Reyes's command of the game's intricacies is insurmountable. Positioning himself flawlessly, Reyes deftly pockets the seven ball, executing a shot along the rail that leaves him primed to line up for the eight ball. With precision, the cue ball brushes against the white ball before settling into perfect alignment for the eight ball. From there, Reyes expertly navigates the side rail, positioning himself for the final shot on the nine ball. Yet, to his surprise, Villarreal interrupts his shot, gracefully conceding the game to Efren Reyes as she exits the match without tasting victory. The two adversaries hug it out, bringing the match between these billiards legends to a close. Later in an interview, Villarreal revealed that she holds Efren Reyes in high esteem as her all-time pool hero. She said that no one can replicate his unparalleled skills, which have rightfully earned him the nickname, The Magician. Even after losing to him in their first match together, they still maintain their close friendship, and to her, Efren epitomizes greatness on the pool table, executing feats that defy all logic. She said that her defeat means nothing, and she still admires him, acknowledging him as her hero and marveling at his ability to perform shots that leave his rivals astounded. So what did you think of Vivian Villarreal trying to humiliate Efren Reyes, and did she get what she deserved? Let us know in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe for more.